Hey guys, a massive thank you to Howl for sponsoring this video. They're a new Rust gambling site with jackpot, coin flip, a free daily case that you can open every day and win up to $700, and free hourly giveaways on the site. Be sure to check them out using my link in the description and I'll see you guys in the video. All right, boys, I'm starting this video off today with something that I normally wouldn't do and that is try to raid a triangle external TC. But this thing is just so weird sitting out here why is it all HQM completely armored? I mean, I know a clan from back in the day that used to survive off of these triangles. I know you can fit a campfire in there and put loot in it, plus a TC. So I've got enough to do one armored wall, 7C4, one rocket. I mean, we know exactly how much this will cost. But yeah, enough talking. Let's just see if this can actually be a stash or if it is just a random TC. Okay, no campfire in there, but it's a solo key lock on it. Yo, let's go, I knew it. Just for no reason for there to be a completely armored external TC out here, let's go. 130 explosives in there, dude. I wonder if we can find enough of these hidden external TCs to make it a full video out of just trying to raid these. But yeah, I'm gonna scout around the map, see if we can find anything else. All of those explosives will pay for what we use, basically. So it's gonna be 24K sold for profit, plus the GP. So we were just scouting for more bases to raid and I think I'm witnessing a massive clan getting raided right now. I don't really want to get involved here. Still have some expo on me. Oh my god, they're rocketing back at him. Yo, this, this could get interesting. Let me get a closer look. Yeah, so this is the raid base and it just hiding out over here behind the TC. But these guys are rocketing and the base owners are rocketing back. I think they're gonna smoke them off. No, it was a regular. Wait, somebody's actually coming up on us. Oh, God. Ooh, yeah. We're not gonna be able to loot that guy. I think we got a kill, though. Um, let's get out of here. <laughs> Shoot. Rip M2. That's E72 clan. These guys are like eight people deep. Shouldn't have messed with them. I was just trying to get close up and watch the raid. All right, we're going to avoid that side of the map. <laughs> Hopefully we can find something on the other side because they will be countering for sure. Okay, well, we will be staying as far as heck away from that raid as we can. We're basically on the opposite side. They shouldn't even be able to hear C4 from over there. But sticking to the basics here with scouting the cliff sides. First, we saw these four sleeping bags on the rock, but then I noticed there is an armored bunker base down here, two by one. Definitely want to go ahead and try to hit this thing. I can almost guarantee you guys that this will be profit. I mean, it's hidden, looks juicy as heck, all armored. Kind of an odd design though, triangle on both sides of the base. I'm guessing, oh, what? I'm gonna say this is TC, but he's got, he's got two entrances, bro. That's not a good idea. Let's go ahead and take the back side. I don't know. I mean, either one will get us to the center. As long as it's not sealed off, we should be able to get some profit here if he's got anything. Yeah, not even sealed off. It's a freaking TC, bro. It's too easy. How are you thinking you're gonna stay secure when you got two doors to the loot, bro? Okay, well, maybe he doesn't have much stuff, and that's why. 2,500 GP. We literally don't even profit from that yet. We need to see some more stuff. Comps, though. He's got 54 tech trash. Let's go. Maybe we can throw a door up here. Literally just an MP5. I kind of want to see where this goes. I know there was a door there, but literally box was completely empty. Doesn't have any weapons on this side. Let's go ahead and see where this door leads. 
do not want to talk about what the heck just happened. But yeah, there were two boxes here. AKs, Customs, MP5s, and LRs. And there we go, 14 C4, 17 rockets. I knew it, he had to have had more stuff than what was in that first room. So yeah, definitely gonna be profit. I mean, you can kind of tell, armored base hit it on a cliff side, like 99% chance that you're gonna get profit. Let's see if we can find anything else on this cliff side, just trying to stray away from that big raid going on for sure. Okay, so we did do a ton of scouting and finally found something here on the shore, but look at it. How many times are you guys gonna do this, bro? My dude is sticking his legs out of the wall, fully geared. We know exactly where the loot's gonna be. The question is, what's gonna be the cheapest way into here? I mean, we could blast through the armored, but as you know, 7C4 in a rocket, pretty expensive. So let's have a look at this thing. I mean, she metal door there. Could be good, could be a bait. Might become sealed off. It is only gonna cost one rocket to check that. Scratch that, we're not taking that. Sheet metal door comes right to here. Yeah, so it's looking like there's literally no way in there. I mean, there's no door pathway. <laughs> I guess it comes down to seven C4 and a rocket. We just gotta hope we see more than like 7K GP to break even in profit. Okay, we've got two sleepers in here, straight to boxes. I mean, it's just too easy when your legs literally stick it through the wall. TC, not even locked. Let's see, which clan actually was this? Oh, well, we can't say that. Just waiting here for a second, get this thing sealed off, and then we'll start checking these boxes. Okay, here we go guys. We know exactly what we need to see to profit. No, <laughs> that's not good. Not a single piece of sulfur in the TC, bro. We need to see rockets or C4 crafted up. Oh my God, dude, totally picked through, bro. Decent amount of tech trash and comps in there. Just like the other one we just raided. There we go, finally 44 rockets. Let's go boys. So yeah, that's back to back armored bases totally paying off. That's what we like to see. Do these guys, maybe they have more loot too. Let's go ahead and check this door. Just a furnace and where did that door lead? Probably just got sealed off. All right, well, that's pretty much going to be it for this one. So yeah, back to back to back armored bases that have profited for us. We also witnessed a massive raid going on. That's where we lost our M249. So I'm going to be trying to do a huge clan, maybe that base that was getting raided. I'm just waiting for some people to hop offline. I'm not able to stay up insanely late tonight. So yeah, we might have to save it for tomorrow night, but make sure you guys get subbed to tune in for tomorrow's raids, hoping to do something huge. I'll see you guys in a bit and please wish me luck.